Hey y'all, this is Toru Imahara here with my 44th part of my Crystal LP. So we're starting off our day with a non-optional trainer battle, or at least I believe it's not optional. I'm going to go backtrack to just to show you, you know, how to get here a little bit. I lost to a trainer named Gamelon and show you an optional trainer. He was really strong, but it was as if he absolutely had to win at any cost. I feel sorry for his Pokemon. Okay. So I'm going to show you an optional trainer. Heal up, because we're about to, you know, hit Victory Road and everything. Because that would be a good idea, you know, before we hit Victory Road to be fully on HP. Because there's a bunch of trainers in there. Or, no, there's not a bunch of trainers. That's only in a, you know, red that there's a bunch of trainers on Victory Road. And in Emerald, there's a bunch of trainers. So, yeah, we just made a cry. So I deposited a bunch of items and I finally got Hotaro back. Now I just need Siddhartha back and, you know, I'll have all my people back. So let's see if there's any items over this way. There is! So I get to show you the way back and I get to show you this item right here. So there you go. We've got a nice little item right there. Okay, awesome. So this is where we were last time. I am going to go heal up. I fought this trainer off screen. And I fought all the optional trainers you can find on your way uh, towards this lady's house here, okay? So in between the Tojo Falls and this lady's house, I took on all the optional trainers there because I skipped over all of them using Surf, being my clever little self. Okay, so there's another optional trainer up this way. Um, he will be done off screen because if you're clever, like I am sometimes, you'll see him. But, if you just do this, he won't see you! So there you go. Optional trainer done off screen eventually. Because uh, there is another optional trainer that I still haven't done yet in Mahogany <laughs> Town. Only trainers who have proven themselves may pass. So we've got all eight badges, so yeah, we're good. This area won't be able to, we won't be able to access until later, so yeah. Don't worry, I will continue the getting all the secrets in both Kanto and Jota region, but I think we'll do that after we beat the rest of the game. I think that sounds like a good idea. That'll be extra videos just because, you know, that way I don't have to worry about, uh, you know, revives and all that stuff. Because, you know, we will finish the game. So here we are in Victory Road. Um, in this area, I've already covered the Pokemon you can find here. But before we go any further, let us use one of our still very mini, mini super repels. Because I believe, you know, it's already gone. <coughs> so let's see what's this way. Nothing. Okay. Well, we're going to be exploring a bit because, you know, I want to try and see if there's any items and stuff. Because I like items. Items are nice things. So this is probably not the way you're supposed to go, but, you know, I'm just, I'm exploring. I like to explore a little. So let's see what's this way. Let's see here. Ooh, there is an item. Let's go get it. Go get the item. Item. We have found an HP up. Very nice. Let's go ahead and use that. Pack. Find the thingy. There you are. And I, uh, you know, deposited a bunch of stuff in my, uh, you know, area. So, let's see here. Least amount of HP is still Hotaru. So, there you go. So, I deposited a bunch of stuff in my uh, item storage. And, yeah, you want to be fairly well healed for this area. Oops. There's an item. But we can't get it. Dang it. So, let's see if there's anything up here. <coughs> there might be. Oh! There's something very important up here. This is the way out. Hold it. Are you, are you going to take the Pokemon League Challenge? Don't make me laugh. You're so much weaker than I am. I'm not like I was before. I now have the best and strongest Pokemon with me. I'm invincible. Toro, I challenge you. So after we fight our rival for the fifth time in this LP, we are going to get those items. I promise. So he's going to start with Sneasel. And we're going to start with Zoe because she's awesome. Now, this is an ice dark type. Hmm, Zoe's weak to ice. So, let's switch to Shiranui here because she just needs to, you know, show up. So, yeah, I'm glad I have most of my team back for this. 
I just don't have Siddhartha, unfortunately. Not very effective. <coughs> so we shall ember you. So yeah, after our rival battle, we will get those items that are in here. Because, you know, we want items. Items are nice. We like shinies. They're my shinies. About to use Golbat. Sure, why not? I know exactly who to use here. I was smart and I got Hotaru. I wish I could have gotten Siddhartha too, but I needed Epic Minion for Waterfall. <sighs> Unfortunately, could not get Siddhartha. So yeah, we're just going to pwn Gamelon with our overlevelness for this area. And yeah, just make him crack. But first, I think we're going to get the save point of, hey, you know, we found the way out, and, you know, it'll be a place that we can fly back to if necessary, I guess. I would like that, you know, registered on our uh, ability to fly to a place. So we're going to earthquake on this dude to make him cry. So, yeah, Zoe's, Zoe's getting pretty close to being what we wanted to be. Which is, you know, level 55, except for <clears throat> Tsubasa. We wanted to be level 57 for a very specific reason. About to use Meganium. We will again. We will use Shiranui and be mean. Because we're smart like that. Yes, we are. So hopefully this video lasts long enough that, you know, we can try and get at least most of the items in this, uh cave area here, if not all of them, because there's no other trainers except for Gamel on here. So yeah, we have plenty of super repels to do that. Okay, Body Slam's a normal type move, however, it can paralyze you, so watch out for that. So yeah. Oh yeah, and for this uh, rival battle, I suggest you be level 40. Oh, nah. Shirinu is fine. He has bite, so that'll just make this haunter cry. Hey. Hi. Hello, Vic Hello, my friend. Oh. We are on Victor. We are we are on Victory Road. Yeah. And we are being very victorious right now because we are poning Gamel on here. About to use Kadabra. Psychic type, I have bite on you. Sure, why not? I would use Siddhartha, but alas, he is not with us because I needed Epic <coughs> Minion for my uh, waterfall. Epic Minion is my uh, shining gear does, by the way. Ah, oh, and, and I, I caught, I caught uh, Suicune with an Ultra Ball. I feel so special. And hurrah, Gamelon was defeated for the fifth time in this LP. I couldn't win. I gave it everything I had, what you possess, and what I lack. I'm beginning to understand what that Dragon Master said to me. And we get money! I haven't given up on becoming the greatest trainer. I'm going to find out why I can't win and become stronger. When I do, I will challenge you, and I'll beat you down with all my power. Hmm, you keep it up at it until then. Okay, so Gamelon's going to go away. And while the super repels up, we're gonna just stay in here and try and get some items until the time runs out. So, okay, repels effect wore off. So we're gonna use another one of our very overbought repels. So, yeah, we have 99 plus 99 plus 2. We're still fine. So going down the hole, because this is a very nice TM here. This is Earthquake. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, it's very nice for us right there. And I don't... I think... Do you have yeah. a dowsing machine in this game? Uh, no, unfortunately you do not. Yeah, you can't find... Well, no, you do get the item finder, finder later, but... Let's see here. Uh, I think this is the way we came. Yeah, this is the way we came. <laughs> so, let's see if there's any... There are more items! See? Exploration's a good thing. So, item... We have found a full heal for free. Never hurts. So see, exploration is a good thing. So this is a max revive. That's nice. Awesome. So this revive will not just heal half of your Pokemon's HP. It'll heal all of their HP. So that's nice for us. So there's no hidden item over there. So yeah. Uh, I think that's again the way we came. 
So we're going to go back. Our Pell's Effect wore off. Well, we have plenty more. So I'm glad I invested in these. Because they're not, you know, they're cheap, easy to buy, and yeah. We're good. So we're going to go up and around and down. So I think we've got all the items. Ooh, there's another item over there. Let's try and see how we can get it. Hmm. Let's see here. Well, that's the way out, so it's obviously not that way. At least not yet. We want to go over there. How do we get over there? Aha! Okay, I figured it out. So we want to go this way. Because we want the item. We like shiny things. Let's see what this shiny is. It is a full restore. Awesome. That will heal all HP and cure any stats. But I think I said that before. So I believe now we have gotten all the items you can find in this area and shoot. Okay, so you just go down like that. Go like that. And we use our final repel that's not a 99. <laughs> so yeah, we still have 99 times 2, whatever that is. And now we are finally getting out of here. I just didn't want to run into any wild Pokemon. So this is Route 23, the shortest route in all of Pokemon. Because look at that. It's just, yeah, th that's it. So now we are finally at the Elite Four at last. Uh, if you want to train some more in the Jota region, you can talk to, hold on. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Oh, okay. Dude. Yeah, you can talk to this dude right here, and he will let his uh, Aber teleport you to the can uh, the Jota region. However, I'm not going to do that because you know, uh, right in the Union Cave is act or the Vic or Victory Road is a really really good place to grind. So finally, since we no longer need Epic Minion for Waterfall, we can deposit Epic Minion at last. And go withdraw. Awesome, awesome Siddhartha. Where are you, Siddhartha? There you are. And now we can finally give him his permanent item and, like, maybe, like, withdraw a bunch of crap. So, let's see here. What do we want to withdraw? Let's see here. I wouldn't mind this HP stuff, but, or this, you know. We're going to want this for the Elite Four eventually. Uh, this is Siddhartha's permanent item. And I gave the, uh, King's Rock, by the way, to, uh, Hotaru. Because I thought that'd be good for her. And, uh, yeah, that's what I did with that. Let's see here. Ghost-type moves. Well, only Siddhartha has that, but that's, you know. His permanent item is the black glasses. Hardstone. Eh, I like the soft sand on her better, but we are going to, if we can, withdraw all these status healing items because you never know We're with the Elite Four. So what I'm going to do is, off screen, I'm going to spam for level 55, but apparently I have no more room for items. So, and we're getting a call from Black Belt Kenji. Um, yeah, I'm going to spam for level 55, except for, you know, Subasa because, you know, I want her to be level, uh... 60? No, I want her to be level 57. This is, there's a reason why it's 57. So, basically what I'm going to do here is sell all the berries, get a bunch of full heals, and yeah, I'm just going to, you know, buy and sell stuff, so it's not too interesting. So, I'll see y'all in part 45, where we are going to take on the Elite Four... So, pray for a whole lot of luck, because even with my slight overleveledness, they are still very hard. So, I'll see y'all in the next episode. TTFN, ta-ta for now.